All right, so here's that building of that base plate for our project. Um, the supplies here we're going to need is a flat plate. Flat plate. We're going to need a C channel. Um, it kind of has a C shape to the end here. So a C channel. Same length as a flat plate. We're going to need five like little hexagon shaped doodads. These are called spacers. Five spacers, all the same size. And we're going to need a total of 13 small little machine screws to bolt it all together. And we're going to need three fasteners with a little star-like looking thing on the back. These are called a star nut. And a tool to assemble it all. It's a hex key. You have two sizes. One size fits the machine screws, one size doesn't. Okay? So we can build most of it, but I don't have all the parts here. So let's build it. All right. So my partner and I are going to grab all the parts for the bins and get them on our table, get them ready to go. Okay. And begin by building this top piece first. Um, the picture in the packet shows that this C channel gets bolted to this flat plate like so and it uses these little spacers to go in between them. Okay, so let's build that first. Um, so I'm going to use these little machine screws and the picture shows that the top and the bottom each get one on both ends, top and bottom, and the exact middle one does. So I'm putting the machine screw from the back through one of the openings. I will cooperate. Okay. I'm just going to hold it in place with one finger and take this little hexagon spacer and it will turn and thread on. It's going to get it hand tight. So holding back here, hold this piece with my finger and just tighten it on to get it hand tight. Perfect. Same thing for the next five. So I'm going to put those together. The next five, exact same way. All right, so all five of the pieces on, they're all hand tight. The corners, the middle, and the corners. Okay. Um, next goes, I'm going to install this little flat plate on top of this piece, the exact same way with the machine screws. They're going to go through the opening in the little spacer, but now I got to use that, there it is, this little tool called an Allen wrench or hex key to tighten it in place. So I'm just going to turn this here until it gets tight. My hand, and then tighten. And again, I'm not going to over tighten it, it's going to just get it tight and stop. Okay? Same for the other ones here, exact same way. Tighten them all in there. All right, so those are all put on installed. Now, the last step is to take this piece and it's going to bolt onto the base plate. And we're going to bolt through this little back tab down through those holes there. And I found it's easiest to have it so it's as close as possible to the edge of this base plate. So I'm going to go, this might be too close where it's hanging over a little bit one square back right there. So I'm going to keep one edge light up. Again, I'm going to use the same setup. I'm taking these um, machine screws. We're going to go through both openings, all three of them. I think I only have two here with me, but you have all three, hopefully. So I'm going to go end on the other end, and then one in the middle. But that one I can't find right now. And then to bolt that together, I'm going to go from the bottom I'm going to support this whole thing doesn't tip off on me. Tip it on the side. And then take one of these machines or hex star nuts, put the star piece to the plate. So I'm going to go star side to the plate. And just kind of start that and get that tight. Other side, same way. Over here, it fell off. 
bolt that doodad through. Again, I'm holding it with one hand, and then tighten on that star nut again. That star side goes to the plate. Get that hand tight. And then, this to for make sure, I'm gonna put that hex key on there and just give it a little bit more tightening, but not much. If I over tighten it, it's very hard to get apart, which is no fun. Okay, so there we have the base plate done. Like the picture shows. The last step is to get some tape, put some tape on this base plate, put your names on it, and put it away for the day.